Van Steen possibly out for the rest of the season with that arm injury. Here's a chance for Marconi early on. Could be Babich. The flag's gone up on this near side, and it won't count. It was a late decision. The two players who are congratulating themselves, Zelko Babich and Christian Kier, have now seen the signal from this official. A great run out of midfield by uh, Marconi and the Kings uh, defence court quite square here. As uh, Babich comes and draws the keeper and uh, really we're looking at the player coming in from the far side and uh, a little bit difficult to call from the top here, Gordon, but that one looks a little bit harsh to me. By involving the other player. The linesman's flag's got up his Lammers. He's pulled it too high. It was a good opportunity for Lammers. He had some space. And the attack breaking down as Renault trying to find Maloney. Rufa skips out of one challenge. Skips out of a second one, went to Rufa. Perry on the outside chose to come inside for Lammers. Perhaps Perry was uh, the better option for Winton Rufa. Babich gets round Moyer. Zelko Babich may go himself. Babich gets a goal and beats Daniel Duke at his near post. Well, Babich had options inside but chose to go himself. Well, this is just uh, sheer confidence and uh, aggression, determination by Babich. Climbs his way through the tackle of Shea Bunce, draws the advancing keeper Duke and really says, this one's going in the back of the net, and this time I'm not offside. We just see uh, David Moyer getting involved in the tackle. Sorry, not Shea Bunce. And uh, Babich putting the uh, finishing touches. Well, great opportunity there, really, for Jonathan Perry. We have seen it on a uh, number of occasions this year. The flag stayed down. Our Atifi a chance to increase the lead for Marconi. Well, he took far too long, our Atifi. And Daniel Duke did ever so well to get down. Some of the Hardy supporters who have turned out on a pretty miserable night in Auckland. Lots of traffic problems on the motorway. As Campbell swings it in again. Looking for Bissolich. He's got the issue. <laughs> defence and connected perfectly with the header Ivan Vislich 1-1 this is what I'm sure that the uh, coaching staff are looking for tonight from Ivan Vislich he does extremely well to get on the end of a very very good delivery here from Jeff Campbell Rufa Rufa to Lammers Lammers for Perry, the flag stayed down, Jonathan Perry, good save by Turnbull. He's got the corner, Perry, but good play by Rufa, good interchange with Lammers. And a nice ball for the Dutchman to find Jonathan Perry, who just couldn't take it away. Campbell delivers again, looking for De Jong. And Turnbull scrambled it away at his left-hand post for another corner. Concerted pressure by the Kings. Boya oh, does well with the header on the edge of the Kings box. A long chance from long way out. Oh, and that struck the bottom of the upright. And almost embarrassed Daniel Duke. Well, that was something out of nothing. Sitting back and allowing players to advance over the halfway line. De Jong. Lamas. Doesn't connect. Campbell. It's all over the place. It's a pinball game in the six-yard box for Marconi. Campbell. Well, that was dangerous for Marconi. Sonata looks for Rufa. Long way out. Good effort from Rufa. That was a screamer from the player coach. And Turnbull did very well. Rufa wins the free kick. McCurney getting around the back of the Kings defence. And uh, Chris Jackson, the player we look at, and that one has certainly made contact on the arm. 
and uh, with the linesman well in vision of that one. Campbell's over to me! And Fred the Long's got one! Well, Turnbull miscalculated. And it's one of the easiest goals for Fred the Young. Great delivery in here to the back stick and completely mistiming and judging the delivery of the flight. And Fred de Jong just, uh, he won't get an easy one with that, but uh, the man again with the delivery, Jeff Campbell, pinpointing that one right on the top of Fred de Jong's head. And a very comfortable second half, Daniel Duke. Lammers, nice touch to Rufa. Looking for Lammers again, a chance for John Lammers! And uh, that one just failing to make uh, contact. Rufa again, nice ball for Perry. This doesn't get a good contact on it, John Perry. This side for Lammers, it must be! Lammers misses another sitter. Well, he's had his chances this evening, John Lammers, and he's squandered them all. Well, Winton Roofer again, deja vu. Roofer into Lammers, and uh, again, the ball's going over the top of the goal. Kenyon does well. Lee Kenyon hands it to Hickey. Roofer's in help. Kenyon's going to be careful, doesn't go offside. Winter Rufa, a chance! And Winter Rufa misses one, and you expect Rufa to hit the target. Well, some of the finishing has left a lot to be desired. Well, this one had goal written over it. Noah Hickey, delightful little layoff there to his uh, player coach, Winton Rufa. But they could have had four or five. Here's Hickey. Chance for Noah Hickey. The angle was acute. It was a good, strong effort from Hickey. Well, the question's been answered. It's Winton Rufa of the veterans who's going to play out the 90 minutes. Silver. Nice run. Hickey. Perry from distance. Great! What a magic effort from Perry. We've seen some screamers this season from the Kings. But that was a peach. Well, Aaron Silva committed aggressive run across the middle of the park here. Slips a lovely ball to Noah Hickey. Jonathan Perry on the right. And this one's got goal written all over it. Follow the leader, says Jonathan Perry. Scored some absolute screamers, have you said, this year, uh, Gordon. And this one's no exception. From the minute it left the boot, that one was goal-bound. Two minutes on the clock. Invincible again, being pushed wide on the right side. Here's Babbage. He's got one this evening. Chance, Trajanovski! Well, we've seen some sitters missed this evening, and Trajanovski adds to a long list. Well, Duke failing to hold this one, and Trajanovski coming in and putting it over the top. And that's easy again for Duke, as the referee brings the game to his conclusion. And a wonder strike from John Perry has confirmed the win but the Kings 
a good value for the three points. Well, it's been since February 19, you've been out of action, you're back against your old club. Get a goal, get the win. Doesn't get too much better, Fred. No, it was a great, great night for us. Um, great crowd. Good guys played really well. Um, yeah, it does, doesn't get much better than this. Would you just stand still for a moment? I know you're pretty excited about this, but what was the difference tonight? I think we just really wanted to win tonight. You know, um, you know we've still got a sniff at the top six, and um, but we've got to keep winning. And uh, yeah, just against Marconi, we beat them last time, beat them again tonight. It's just a great feeling.